Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, almost 80 degrees in some spots today. Temperatures topping out well into the 70s. But look at the highs and notice the big difference along the South Shore. Cooler, and the reason why, sort of its own little microclimate today. Places like Newport and Eric Hansett, the clouds off the ocean, and even some areas of fog just hugging the South Shore all day long. So naturally limited sunshine, the wind off the water. It was cooler, but all you had to do was drive three, four miles away from the coastline to have the sunshine. And as a result, inland areas were well into the 70s, almost 80, 77 in Providence, topped out at 78 degrees in Boston. The normal high is 58, so well above average. Dry skies, nothing on Doppler radar, a few patchy clouds, but the humidity levels are dropping off as we say goodbye to today's spring-like weather. Much cooler air on the way. I mean, nothing unusual for this time of year, just getting temperatures back to normal. Halloween weekend, is it a trick or a treat from Mother Nature? We'll take a peek at that seven-day future cast in a couple of minutes. Providence now clear skies and a temperature still quite mild in the upper 50s. A north-northwest breeze at 10 is a dry wind direction, so the humidity levels much lower than what we've had over the last couple of days. Jerry LaRoche and Warren has 56 clear, mild, and dry after a high today of 71 degrees. Most spots now are in the mid to upper 50s from Cumberland and Johnston and Coventry. Tiverton now with uh, partly cloudy skies and 58. Other locations with similar temperatures this evening, mid and upper 50s, westerly at 50. Some showers well offshore. Notice the clouds to our north and west through upstate New York and southeastern Canada. These are headed our way, but not until tomorrow afternoon. This cloud cover actually represents much cooler air. Not cold, but certainly cooler. You can see the shades of blue across the Great Lakes as that cooler air works in over the next several days. So overnight tonight, cool, but not terribly cold. It'll stay well above freezing as temperatures drop through the mid-40s under clear skies. Kids heading out to school tomorrow morning or heading out to work. We start with sunshine around 8 o'clock in the morning, 47 degrees. The brightest part of the day would be during the morning. The clouds take over in the afternoon, becoming mostly cloudy. That will cap the temperature not much higher than 57 degrees, and that's a solid 20 degrees cooler than what we had today. But these numbers are close to average for late October. And again, during the afternoon, I do expect a lot of clouds around. Uh, a northwest breeze at 12 to 18, a dry wind direction. Similar temperatures across southeastern Mass, mid and upper 50s by 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Halloween weekend looks dry. 50s in the day, 30s and 40s at night. Some extra clouds on Sunday afternoon, 53, so chilly. Kids heading out for trick-or-treating on Sunday evening evening temperatures will drop into the 40s and next week no 60s or 70s but rather 50s for daytime highs you may see a couple of showers on tuesday but no major storms on the horizon some extra clouds tomorrow afternoon a lot cooler what you would expect for late october looking good for the ghosts and goblins sunday night yes it is okay. thanks tony coming up next